All votes have been counted and verified. Achieving more than 50% of the vote, I am delighted to declare Naomi Long MLA elected as party leader. I feel quite excited. It's a daunting prospect um, to lead the party and a huge responsibility, but I think um, just judging by people in the room tonight, the enthusiasm and the energy that was here, um, it's a really exciting time to be in that leadership position and I'm really looking forward um, to starting the processes that we were talking about this evening in terms of reaching out beyond um, our, our current boundaries, trying to expand the party and grow the party for the future um, and to clarify our message for a new generation of voters. I think anyone in the room this evening will have seen that we have a party that has the most diverse membership of any party in Northern Ireland. Um, we have a party that is in good spirit um, and is also in good strength. And from our perspective, that's a great base to have to work from. But we also have a party that is full of enthusiastic people, people who are passionate about our policies and who want to get involved and get active. And I think there are real opportunities for us to harness that energy and to really make a change in Northern Ireland. Well, there are there are some priorities that I have in terms of what we want to do. The party, um, we've talked about this, about going through a refreshing process, with a, a renewal process uh, with the party, and we will do that over the coming weeks. But in the immediate term, what we need to do is continue to provide robust opposition in Stormont, a proper challenge to the government, and also on occasion, a proper challenge to the official opposition, to ensure that the people from, of Northern Ireland, whom we represent, are getting the best government that they can. We've already seen growth in terms of local councillors and the expansion. We have seven out of 11 councils. We have people from Alliance represented on those. There is an opportunity, I believe, over the coming weeks and months to set out a plan that will actually allow us not just to grow in those areas, but actually grow beyond. We're already recruiting members in those areas, and I think the opportunities are ripe. And finally, moving away from politics, I've been told to ask you how Daisy is going. Daisy is much better. She is every bit the rascal this evening that we are used to, and we are very relieved for the care that she has received. Um, it was touch and go on Sunday night. She was in very poor shape, um, but much better this evening, and hopefully will be home with us tomorrow, and we'll be able to celebrate. I want to thank you for your commitment to support me in the months ahead, as together we build a shared future. Thank you. Naomi has worked with me as deputy leader for a number of years. I'm delighted now that she's taken over as leader. I have absolutely no doubt that she'll provide strong leadership for the party as we seek to grow and develop in the coming years. Well, absolutely delighted. Okay. Absolutely delighted that Naomi Long has been elected our new leader this evening, following on after 15 incredibly uh, hard-working years by David Ford, who has set a tremendous foundation for this party. And I wish Naomi all the best in the world, and I think she is going to be a very attractive political party leader who will bring new members into this party, will reinvigorate this party, and will take us to even newer places than David Ford did. Naomi's great. I mean, David Sonny brought us through difficult times and he's, he's increased our votes, our number of, of MLAs. But we're stepping into a new era. Uh, a younger leader, a female leader, and um, really I think, you know, her message of reaching out, widening our appeal, uh, widening our, our, our scope and, and, and geographically. So I think it, it's very upbeat.